Honey strong, honey strong. What's that word, family? Hey, man, check this out. All right, folks, we really got to get serious about this Caitlin Clark situation. You know, it's a lot of hate being thrown at this young lady who just started her professional basketball career. And it's coming from black women and white women. Some white women feel like they've been in the league and they're not getting the attention of Caitlin Clark. So what the hell is Caitlin Clark? Well, let me tell you something, man. A lot of this hate is generated by the fans out there. These fans are generating the hate. And the basketball players, sadly to say, they falling right into it. It's not white or black, man. It's basketball. If she's a cold-ass basketball player, let her be what she is. She's elevating the game, if you ask me. I'm not a fan of the WNBA, even though I live in Iowa. I'm not a fan of Caitlin Clark, and I never watched a Iowa Hawkeyes women game. And I don't think I ever watch a WNBA game unless I'm someplace where I can't control the devices, right? I don't give a shit. But what I do care about is all you veteran black women and all you younger black women, y'all hating on Caitlin Clark. It, it, it don't look good, man. You know, I'm from Chicago. So, of course, if I'm a root for any team, it's going to be the sky. But I'm from Chicago, and I now live in Iowa, and I never watched a basketball game between Caitlin Clark and nobody. I don't give a shit. But what I do care about is the way all women are acting on this basketball court, man. Could you imagine the men acting like this? This takes us back. So that's exactly what it's doing to the women. Men didn't act like this after the 80s. When the 90s started coming in, more rules came into play, and men decided, hey, it ain't even worth it. You know, men can compliment each other. Women can't do it. Just imagine living in a world where eight superpowers had female presidents at the same time. Bro, we talking about global catastrophe because these women, their emotions are everywhere. They can't control themselves. And it's a damn shame that I have to get up here and say this. Men know how to resolve conflict or elevate the conflict, all depending on the situation. These women are elevating a conflict that doesn't even exist. And when you got people out there that's on your own team, that's not having your back, it's crazy to me. And this ain't even a racial situation for the basketball players. It's only the fans that's making it a racial situation. So all y'all do is get online, read the comments of Caitlin Clark fans, and go play basketball against her and determine that tonight you're going to hurt a young lady that haven't done nothing to nobody when it all boils down. And I know I got an unpopular opinion, but what I'm trying to do is – be unbiased, man. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to be objective because this is getting out of hand, out of control. It really don't make any sense, man. Y'all should be happy that you no longer have to fly Spirit Airline and you can fly private jets. Thanks to Caitlin Clark. Angel Reese has something to do with it as well, but it's mainly because of her. Let's keep it real. It's mainly because of her. Now, as far as the teammates letting her get jumped on, attacked, and beat. Imagine somebody sucker punched a pitcher, a white pitcher. You know that the black teammates are going to come in and fight. And I'm talking about the men. They're going to come in and fight for that white player, man. That's how y'all are supposed to protect Caitlin Clark, protect the asset, man. If she's the best player on the team, she's the – damn best player on the team. You can't do nothing about it. God made her the best player on your team at this particular point. But it's just sickening to me to see these women doing these things, man, and falling into the traps. Soon somebody get hurt, then what's going to happen? Your ass going to be sitting in jail crying, wishing that you was out living your best life while you was playing basketball. It's just crazy to me, man. Tell me how y'all feel about this situation in the comment section. I wouldn't want to be a part of a team with teammates that don't help you when the going get tough, especially if you look at Kayla. She's a little-ass woman. She's little. She's not big, man. She's not, not 
Brittany Griner or nothing like that, man. She's she small. Y'all out there putting y'all hands on this woman, man. This shit is crazy. It's ridiculous. And all the fans, man, y'all can shut the fuck up, too. Every stat y'all put, oh, this, 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 this. Man, shut up, man. Y'all making the situation worse. But them fans, a lot of them are trolls. You guys are supposed to be professionals. Tell me how y'all feel about this in the comment section. I'll be back later. Peace. Fresh, I apply the pressure, yeah, fresh, fresh, I apply the pressure.